So, Ducky, and today I'm going to teach you how to make a realistic ball in Paint 3D. So, um, first what I did, I just grabbed a circle from 2D shapes, and I made it bigger, but it doesn't really matter to make it bigger or smaller. I prefer big because it's way easier, way more easier to do. Paint 3D is just, I think it's only for computer and the only windows, so yeah. So what you want to do after you're done getting the circle done is grab the watercolor brush and then make a light green. So uh, after that, uh, turn up your thickness up, not all the way, well you can make it all the way, uh, can turn up the, the thickness all the way, but I, it, it doesn't really matter. If you mess up, it's okay, you can clean it up with it. But you need to focus on doing all the shades and stuff. So, what I did was, well, what kind of a dumb move, but um, before you even start making shades or anything like that, please make the, the arrow because that is where the light is going to be hitting the ball. But after you're done doing all that, make a, uh, a dark green. The reason why I say this is because you're going to be lost, trust me. Sometimes I didn't even do it, but, but you're going to be lost because you don't even know where the light is going to be hitting the ball, and you don't have any, I mean, guideline, or, I shouldn't say, but you ain't, you ain't got no, uh, I shouldn't say, but you ain't got nothing you don't know where to start so you can make the shit. So after that make a dark So after that, make your thickness come up. I'm about uh, almost to 100 pixels, I think, or just 50 pixels. I don't know. Um, but after you're done making the scoop for the shade, uh, fill it up. Fill below this one. Um, just fill the bottom. So, this is where the tricky parts 
the tricky part comes. Um, blending. Yeah. It is not fun to blend. But it is pretty fun whenever you want. So we'll basically turn down the activity and then do two, three, um, yeah, two or three swoops of the dark green and then come back with the, the, um, the primary color and then just do swoops over the dark green. And then as you can see, it made a tiny little blend. So that's how you blend in Fate 3. Um, I'm pretty sure that there's other techniques to blend in this, but that's um, the way that I blend. So, we're going to be doing this one more or two more times to um, get that realistic look. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much what you're going to be doing for the next time, I guess. Um, yeah, enjoy the video. That's all I got. That's all the information that I need to put out. So, this is the other complicated part. Light. Realistic light. Um, 
many other artists out there, including me, have a problem with lighting and shape. But, um, yeah, lighting is probably the most complicated part. Because you have to, sometimes you have to desaturate, saturate. But, yeah. Um, basically, what I did, I just randomized. I just put random colors up. Not random, I picked white, but I was just like, you know what? Forget it. I'll just I'll just do something about it. I just had a brain fart. I paused and I was like, what am I gonna do? But um yeah, I just turned down the activity, turned down the thickness, grabbed the white from the color chart, and then just added little tiny portions of white. So yeah, that's pretty much what I do for the white. Um, yeah, that's all I got. So, I got lazy. I legitimately got lazy. Um, I was basically just trying to clean up the mess that I did out of the line of the circle. So I was like, okay, I'm going to try to clean this up because it kind of looks like a mess. But after a while, I got lazy. I didn't want to do it. I was like, I'm going to waste too much time on this. I got to do some stuff. And I was just like, I don't care. I would just let it be. So, yeah, I got late. And after a while, I kind of liked it. It kind of looked like a like a natural watercolor. Of course, it's going to look like a watercolor because I was using one. But, um, yeah, I was just like, you know what, forget it. I'm not going to do it. So, um, yeah. Okay, I'm back. Please do not do what I did a few minutes back because that was just stupid of me. I was actually trying to do something new because that's just stupid. All you literally have to do is make a straight line. Well, that's way more simpler than just making all this nonsense. But yeah, that's just my tutorial of to make a realistic green ball or paint 3D. I think that's gonna be it for today. Um, subscribe, hit that like button, and comment down below which other thing I should draw on paint 3D. Peace.